Hey y'all, today we have a super simple crock pot recipe of cube steak and gravy. This is sort of like a Salisbury steak meal where we serve it over either potatoes or rice, um, but you're just not gonna believe how easy this recipe really is. I start with one can of cream of chicken soup. You can also use cream of mushroom soup if you would rather. This is a 10 and a half ounce can. Then I add one package of onion soup mix. You can get the beefy onion soup mix or just the onion soup mix, either one. I'm gonna pour that in. And then a packet of this gravy mix. Not real sure how that's pronounced. Au jus, maybe, don't know. You can use regular gravy mix packet if you want. I think this just has a little different flavor. And then a half cup of water, or I have beef broth left from a recipe that I made the other day, so I'm gonna use a half cup of beef broth. Either one is fine. I love a recipe where you have options. I'm just gonna give this a good mix. Now the crock pot will create some moisture as this dish cooks. So it's not necessary to have a whole lot of liquid or your gravy will be too runny. And I've got a package of cube steak here. What I like to do is just cut mine in half so that we've got a little better serving sizes here. And we just put this down into the gravy. I'm just gonna to toss these around to make sure each one of them has a little bit of the gravy on there. Now at this point, you can add any seasonings or spices that you like. Y'all know what I like. I like garlic powder and black pepper. I would not recommend adding any salt to this. Now we'll just put a lid on this. We're gonna leave it for about five to six hours and then we'll see what it looks like. Okay, it's ready, so we're going to put some on a plate and see how it turned out. I made some rice in my rice cooker with a little beef broth. That's why it's not really white. And there's our cube steak. Smells so good. I steamed up a little broccoli to go with it. Simple and easy, and everybody loves it. Let's have a taste. Super tender. Mmm, perfect. Thank you all for watching. I hope everyone has a wonderful week. We'll see you next time.